Dude, so like, I'm trying like shivers right now, like this whiskey. Man, this shit's rough. I put ice in it to see if it might help, but man, this shit does not help. This shit fucking, it's tough to drink. The hell? Let's dance. What? Ow! Why? Ow! Why? Ow! I just got on! Ow! Bro, I literally was just walking. Hey, I'm walking here. I fucking hate you, dog. Give me your head. Or I'll take your legs too. Take this, burn it, hide it, whichever. Just don't get caught. Oh, I saw that uh, Valve announced uh, Counter Strike Two. I'm excited to try that out, to be honest. I kind of want to see how that, like, fucking goes. I feel like that'd be a lot of fun. Um, my question is, is what the fuck are they going to change up from, like, CSGO? I mean, there's probably a lot to change up. But, like, I don't know what they would change up specifically. Maybe add utility, new weapons. Obviously, new maps. They're going to add new maps. I wonder how it's... I wonder if they're doing just, like, a full new game. Or if it's just going to be, like, CSGO. I mean, because, like, they... How what did they change up from like source at least to go CSGO? Like new maps. They didn't really change up the weapons too much. Maybe the way the gunplay is gonna be played out, maybe new utility, that type of stuff. I don't know. So now that I finished Yakuza Kiwami, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take it to I'm gonna take a short break from playing Yakuza. And I'm gonna actually finish up uh, Fallen Order. Because I haven't finished up Fallen Order at all. And I really wanna finish it before Survivor comes out. And then afterwards, uh, we're gonna play. We're gonna we're gonna go play Yakuza Kiwami Two. Let's see where we go from there. Seems my cabaret dreams are about to come true. So. Oh, yep. This is the part. I remember this. Mm. Sure. Why not? Why not? That's my boy. Dash my boy. The foreman mentioned he saw you and Priscilla talking. He's all right. And. She say anything about me? Um, <laughs> yeah, she said you're fat and you smell. <laughs> oh she my god. Said something that made me think she's not entirely normal. What? That you're responsible. Got your feet planted firmly on the ground. You're pulling my leg. Not this time. I was gonna say, is a part of Dandelion's head missing? It was just like that was the, like that was like a weird ass angle. Master Dandelion, Priscilla, she's what? Speak, man. She's badly hurt. Uh, been attacked. They, they took her to Vomerius Hospital. Attacked? She's hurt. Geralt, come with me, please. Yeah. Of course. Let's go. Let's roll. Yeah, now I remember. Now I'm starting to remember. For some reason, I couldn't remember the first half of this quest, but now I remember it vividly. Like, very vividly now I actually remember this quest. Priscilla. Is she gonna live? Well, I'd say that's certain. Her condition's critical, but stable. I beg your pardon, but you are a relative? R relative? No, a friend. A very close friend. Dandelion, correct? She uttered the name in her few moments of lucidity. I am Joachim von Graz, head of surgery. Until recently, a lecturer at Oxenfurt Academy. Enough of the courtesies. What are her injuries, besides her eye? A concussion, cranial swelling, incision into her larynx, and scalding inside the throat and esophagus. Clearly, someone forced her to imbibe a caustic fluid. Ugh. Wait. So this was no ordinary attack, no robbery. Clearly not. It was the act of a demented mind, and not its first. How can you know that? I've seen wounds like this. They're not the kind one would forget, don't you agree? In fact, just this week a corpse turned up in the morgue with similar injuries. And no heart. No heart? You mean that might have happened to Priscilla? Is someone looking into this? This is Novigrad. Only the innocent burn here. Geralt, I know I owe you a hundred times over, but I need to ask you another favor. Find the bastard who did this. Okay. Find him and kill him. 
Okay. Don't need any convincing. Come on, Dandelion. Let's think about what we can do. I... I would suggest examining the previous victim's corpse. It has yet to be autopsied. Doing so could very well provide some clues. No need to look astonished, gentlemen. As a surgeon, I know the importance of preventive medicine. Rather than wait for this maniac to strike again, I'd prefer to excise him. Not unlike a tumor. Wait, wasn't like one of these guys like a vampire? I swear I remember. I don't know. I feel like I remember like this quest. Like one of them was like a vampire or he was like a higher vampire or some shit. I know it's something along those lines. What the hell is this place? You there. This damn lid won't budge! God. Whoever put it on the sarcophagus was clearly thinking about grave robbers. Uh, you've no idea who I am, have you? None. Professor Vermont John, Oxenfurt University, Faculty of Applied Archaeology. As a certain ancient map would have it, there's a priceless elven tome in this sarcophagus, the Darar Manuscript. It could shed entirely new light on the NL Shay conflict. So, will you help? Sure, why not? All right, let's open it. Blood are glowing. Vampire. Probably regenerates Oh, here. God! Just five more minutes. Is it 1358 yet? No. Then fuck off. <laughs> I'm not fucking with a vampire. Never running into things like that. Well, come on. Open it again. Why? See an elven manuscript there? Because I sure as hell didn't. I haven't the chance to look. Perhaps he enjoys bedtime reading and keeps it under his pillow. Do we want to wake him up? Nah, let's wake him up. <laughs> Fine, I'll open it again. Uh, I don't think that was a good idea, though. Again? Do you fucking plan to come knocking once an hour now? Enough! Oh, God! Oh, no, never mind. It wasn't even. It's not a higher vampire. It's just a catacan. Okay, cool. Show yourself, coward! Ow. Slow down! I thought it was a higher vampire for a second, dude. I don't think we actually run into any vamp, like actual higher vampires, though. Not until uh, we get into blood and wine. That's when we do. That's when we actually run into a higher vampire. I still think it's so crazy, though, how at least in the lore for The Witcher, like no one can kill, like no one can actually legitimately kill a higher vampire. It's impossible. The only way to kill a higher vampire is to have another vampire eat that or kill that vampire. And usually like, at least in Blood and Wine, it was like through method of um, eating. Like I think at least Regis ends up killing um, Detloff through like, just like fucking feasting on, feasting on his corpse. But that's how like, oh fucking OP higher vampires are though. Catacans aren't too bad. Um, because at least they can be killed, but they're still pretty fucking strong. Any vampire is strong in general, but like Katakans and Ekimaras and Kikimors are pretty fucking strong. How do I know this? Because I'm a fucking nerd. Next, the killer removed the eyes, placed burning coals in the sockets, then opened the rib cage, and... What's this? A parchment made of human skin. A message from the murderer, the name of his next victim. Patricia Vagelbud. Do you know her? Yes. Even went to her estate once with... Gotta find her. Now. Oh! Dude, I always forget how crazy this shit is. You're basically... This is, this is fucking crazy. You're basically cra catching a crazy priest guy who's on a killing spree. KILLING SPREE! Calm and quiet. All seems to be in order. We should go in, just to be sure. You're relentless, aren't you? Fine. But wait here, please. Mother's certainly not in the mood for guests. Bro, my question is, is how that motherfucker get in the, <laughs> the estate? He, he ran out the other door. Catch him. Told you. Get away from me, stupid dog. 
Stupid dog, you make me look bad. Ah, son of a bitch. I guess I gotta fight my way out. Wait, did I make a bad decision there? Was I not supposed to fight them? Wait a second. Was I was I able to save Patricia? We got him, Lady Ingrid. Wasn't easy, but lower that crossbow before you hurt yourself. This man is innocent. Wait, her eyebrows. <laughs> I saw him running. Thought it was the killer fleeing. I was chasing him, and I'd have caught him if you hadn't gotten in my way. Out of my sight at once. Mother. Why did he do this to her? Why? I think just, I really think it's because of the entire she ba basically anybody who's like against the eternal fire this man murders I think because she blasphemed the eternal fire only thing that ties her to the other victims Ingrid I know this is a hard time for you but usually the killer leaves a note on the body a note indicating his next victim may I very well but you should be on your own I do not wish to see her in this state. I do not wish to remember her like that. And let her be the last victim. Please. Wait, I don't think we could say we were able to save her, right? Here it is. Sweet Nettie, crippled Kate's. Growing bolder, not just the name, but the place too. Won't get away this time. Found a message on Patricia's body. Led me here to crippled Kate's, to Sweet Nettie. If you didn't leave it, who did? I don't know, but I see we must talk calmly. Who knew you'd be here? Strangely enough, I don't announce these outings far and wide. There's but one man who... That, that's impossible. He treats even corpses with kid gloves. The coroner said you were busy, that you wouldn't visit the morgue. Gotta go after him. Go, but to where... Wait, no, 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 no! He's there this time of day procuring supplies. You're weak. Wait, so it's not just wait, 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 wait a second. So he's not the. It's not just him. Wait, so Nathaniel. Wait, 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 wait. I'm so confused. Wait, so it's it's not just him. It's Nathaniel. It was the other guy. Wait. Wait a second, dude. I initially thought that it was just one person, but it's multiple people, bro. This is some, this is some deep state level conspiracy going on here. What? Hold the phone. Run out of formaldehyde. I underestimated you. You almost caught me in flagrante delicto. Now you've seen through my bluff with Nathaniel. Although, you've not divined all, I see. Had you, you would have drawn your silver sword. Who, what are you? A vampire? Hire of- God! I knew it! Got a reason for killing? A reason to torture? Hmm. I thought you'd figure that out as well. The symbolism is rather obvious. Coals for those who are blind to the fire. The egg of a salamander born of fire to replace their cold, doubting hearts. Fire down the throat. Yeah, symbolism's clear. What's not is why a vampire would kill in the name of the eternal fire. Should be equally obvious. I concur with the church's diagnosis. Novigrad is a fallen city. Its population amnesiacs to the very concepts of decency and morality. So I decided to remind them in a manner they'd be certain to notice. <laughs> You're out of your fucking mind. You're a sick fuck. <laughs> I never expected you to understand. You're a cynic and an opportunist. I sensed it from the start. Ah, well, this conversation has grown unpleasant for both parties. We must move to the next item on the agenda. I last fought a witcher two centuries ago. I do hope I remember how it's done. And you? Have you faced one of us? No, you couldn't have. You would have survived. Oh, fuck me. How long are you gonna make me wait? 
No, wait, this isn't a legit higher vampire. Dude, this guy's a pussy. This, this isn't Regis or like fucking Detloff or any bullshit, man. This guy is a little pussy bitch. I forgot what bomb I used in order to get him out of that form. I think it's moon. I, I need some moon dish. Oh god. Wait, do I have my silver sword? I do have my silver sword out. Okay. I can't I can't use my uh moon, moon dish. It still don't matter though, just because I still do a fuck ton of damage here. Wait, so I was right though. Oh no, I so I think I remember what I did last time. Last time, like I I think I chose like that decision where I was trying to see like more and then yeah I ended up finding out that it was a higher vampire we had a fight though But like I said this guy is in a uh, This guy isn't a legit higher vampire though. Did you take care of What I asked? Yeah The witcher's way Thank you Geralt For me and Priscilla No need Don't mention it Nothing a friend wouldn't do She's talking again. Nice surprise. Isn't it? Professor Vargas told me her wounds are healing faster than a troll's. Not the most flattering comparison, but encouraging. Maybe she might even sing again someday. For now, we'll try performing as a duo. She'll play the lute, I'll sing. Dandelion and Kalanetta. Got a nice ring to it, doesn't it? Sounds great. Good luck, Dandelion. On stage and off. Wait, let me talk to this guy. Found and killed the murderer. It was Hubert. You were right not to trust him. He was a higher vampire. I thought nothing could surprise me in Novigrad. Seems I was wrong. Deeply wrong. Thank you, Geralt. Were it not for you, this would never have ceased. 